it needed to be. This is what it feels like. What it needed to feel like. Man, I think it's been it's been what it what it needs to be and more. You know what I mean? Um, I think this is a great move I made. Um, I mean, look, I'm active. You know, I just fought January. I'm ready to fight again in April. You know, that's something that I haven't I had ahead. You know? So, so I'm excited just just on that that part. You know what I mean? Um, you know, and then then look for the stage I'm fighting. You know, fighting a pretty, probably the biggest card of the year. You know, probably the, I don't even know if the rest of the year will be a big card like this. So, so you know, I'm excited to showcase my talent, my skills, um, whether it's it's, it's Haney or Garcia or whether it's you know whoever I find the call, man. I'm gonna put out, I'm gonna put up a show either way. All right, and then you fight in New York, man. Yeah. Does it get any bigger than that? I don't think, and if I recall correctly, I don't think you've had a big fight there or you've been on a big card there. Tell me what it feels like going to New York City, being in the big part of this uh, major card. Um, and you know, those fans, they're different out there. <laughs> so, no, hey, man. You know? no, man, look, I've never fought in New York. This is going to be an honor. Um, I'm excited, you know, and I think I have the the style to to, to uh, entertain the fans. You know what I mean, I'm not, you know, I'm not gonna be there running around the whole ring. So so you know, I think New York's gonna love me, man. I think they love my style. You know, we're gonna find a you know a dance partner that's gonna match my style, so it can be just fireworks for the night. It could be like the nice appetizer, you know, and they might get full before the main event, so they might not even want the main deal, the main meal. You know what I'm saying? And lastly, you're gonna you're gonna have tons of Latinos in there, yeah. New York City, you know, Mexican, Puerto Rican, Dominican, whatever's gonna be there. You know, it's it's all about supporting um, another Latin fighter going into it. Um, what do you want to say to them, you know, to, to get them to pay attention to what you got going on and the fight that you have on April 20th at the full main event? Oh man, I want them to tune in. You know, I want them to tune in. You know, I want them to, 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 to you know, to see what a real Mexican fighter is going to fight like. You know what I mean? And, um, and I want them to become, you know, to start following me after that and hopefully I be, uh, they, they get, become a fan of me. Right. Thank you so much. I appreciate, appreciate you. Thank you. I don't know. Long time coming, brother. Hey, what's up, my boy? Doing good, brother. So, obviously, like, we know the struggle you've been going through, you know, being patient, being with Bob. You're finally here. Uh, what does it mean, you know? First of all, what do you think of the show right here? Man, you know what? It was a show, you know what I mean? It was cool. You know, it was cool. You know, uh, one of the girls that, that did a freaking flip almost knocked out my table, bro. You know, I was like, hey, what the heck? You know, caught me off guard, but yeah, it was cool, man. You know, it was cool. Um, you know, it was, you know, uh, see, like you said, man, to finally get, you know, the recognition, it, it, it's, it's amazing, man. It's pretty cool. And of course, for Oscar to bring you here, you know, he has you slated for the co-main. Um, obviously, you give your thoughts on, you know, thinking, hey, if one of these guys fall through, I'm here. What does it mean for you to give that message to Oscar and to let him know that you are here? No, man, you know, it's important, you know what I mean? Because that just shows, you know, Golden Boy and Oscar, I'm reliable, you know what I mean? And, and, and you know, I, like you said, I'm the co-main, so I'm going to show up no matter what, you know what I mean? But if one of these guys falls and it happens to me to be my opportunity, then I'm going to take full advantage of it. Like I told Devin Haney, I told Bill Haney, hey, look, like, Thank you, congrats on making the fight. If this guy drops out, I'm getting that ass. You know what I mean? We saw that little dab between you and yeah, Devin. Yeah. Do you feel like there's mutual respect there between you guys? Of course, of course. You know, um, Devin's never rubbed me wrong. He's never said anything bad about me. You know, I know that, you know, that, that he, he has mentioned my, like, I've messaged him on Instagram personally and told him that I wanted to fight him. He said, hey, you know what, we can make that fight happen. So, it's a lot of respect, man, you know, and uh, I think it'll be even more respect if we were to both fight in the ring. And what are your thoughts on, obviously, the stuff that's been going on, you know, social media? Of course, people have, uh, you know, their their opinions about, you know, Ryan and the antics. Uh, what message do you have, you know, for the fans, for Oscar? You know, it's almost as, it's almost as if, like, hey, if, if he's not ready, put me in, Coach. Oh, yeah, you know, um, listen, the, the so, social media, I don't pay attention to what, 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 what he's doing or what they're doing, you know what I mean? I just seen the little jump rope thing, and I seen that, you know, you know me, like, like I said, you know, they're doing stuff on there, and I'm, gr I'm grinding, you know what I'm saying? That I'm, I'm training, my team, we're training, you know, this, this is what got me here. And this is the way I, I am, you know me, man. You know, so I'm in the gym 24/7. So, so that they can go ahead and do all that, you know what I mean? So I, I'm just focused on um, I'm April 20th, and, and I'm excited, man. You know, I'm excited to go to New York and fight for the fans out there. And we saw we saw Ryan kind of, you know, do the yeah. little hand sign. Do you feel he's just overlooking you right now? And he, should he have a little bit more respect for the work that you've done throughout your career? Yeah, I mean, I don't think he knows who I am. You know what I'm saying? I don't think he really pay attention, but he, he better. You know what I'm saying? I'm 29 and 0 for a reason. You know, I never I never quit. I've never lost, you know what I mean? Uh, I've never, you know, he never quit in a fight. So he better recognize who I am, man, because, you know, who knows, man? It could be him that's next. And a message to the people of El Monte, you know, obviously oh, they know all these things in boxing, but now they're seeing you and they know like, what you're about. What message do you have to your people? Oh, man, you know what? Um, I just want to tell them, man, keep, keep supporting, keep following, man. Uh, and I'm the underdog of the city, baby. You know, I'm happy to be it. Awesome, bro. Glad to see you on the stage, bro. Thank you, bro. Appreciate it, man. Thank you.